I just learned about the death of Father Simon Peter Lokodo, formerly the Minister of Ethics and Integrity, and currently he has been a committee member of the Human Rights Commission. Father Lokodo died after making a presentation as part of the team that presented before the United Nations Human Rights Commission yesterday, Friday, a very hostile group that was demanding that Uganda legalizes homosexualism, illegitimates transgenderism, and makes acceptable gay marriages. This must have stressed Father Simon Lokodo. And his death, to me, creates in my mind, was there foul play? Was there foul play that this man who was apparently normal when he traveled ended up dying this morning? It's become very fashionable for Europeans and Americans to look at Africans who are straight, who are civilized, who are godly, as somehow mentally sick. Somehow they call us homophobic, they call us many names, backward, unsophisticated, and they seek to destroy us. I write about this in my upcoming book, Straight Nation Uprising, and I write how, with the passing of time, more and more efforts are being made to destroy the African resistance by targeting specifically those who articulate our culture, our faith, and our religion. Father Simon Peter Lokodo was one of those. His sudden abrupt death in Geneva raises troubling question. He was in the midst of a conference where he was answering, where he was being attacked together with a delegation from Uganda. They were being attacked and harangued. Why are there no gay rights? I recall that on the other side, when David Kato died, another campaigner for the other side, the entire Western industrial complex was beating down Uganda to find out what happened. And in, in the end, justice wasn't really served. I also want to ask the same thing. What has happened? We must know what happened in Geneva. What happened to Father Simon Lokodo, a man from Karamoja who was representing us? I'm bothered about it.